Hello everyone, welcome once again to my channel. This is Janice May and today I would like to show you how to cut your paper strips using a template. Um, but before that, you may have noticed that I'm wearing my print fresh pajamas. <laughs> I have another pair, but for some reason this print is soft and very comfortable. The other pair has like a sun face embroidery in it and it's a little stiff uh, maybe because of the embroidery. Anyway, I tried to do a collaboration with them so that we can get coupons and discounts, mm -hmm. all kinds of good stuff, hopefully. So anyway, the project today will be cutting your paper strips using a template that you pre-made and you can photocopy it if you want to make several, you know, and you can coordinate the color of your template with the magazine page that you're gonna be doing it on because you can actually roll this together with your, um, with your magazine strips. I'll show you what I'm talking about because it's kind of like confusing right now, especially if you're a beginner. You will put a glue stick, you will stick this onto your chosen magazine page. I would suggest something like this. So they're like almost the same size. And then you cut them, you stick this onto the page and then you cut them now I'll be using my guillotine cutter. I'll be using that to cut the paper strips. So let's get to it. So you will need a glue stick and you choose the page that you think will go with your, will go with the color of your, of your uh, pattern. So this I think would look nice. So what I need to do is cut it. Cut it or just tear it. <laughs> okay. So now that you have that, um, you take your glue stick and you will put, you will run it through here, your, at the, one edge, a short edge of your magazine page, and I would just adhere that onto here, okay? So, there you go. So, what you're gonna be doing is you'll be cutting this. You're on the pattern, the visible line, and you have your magazine here. I had to take the camera off from its uh, base so that I can show it to you up close. So it looks like this now, right? And that's your intended magazine page. And what you do is you just put this in here and start cutting it. If you don't have a guillotine cutter, you can just cut them with scissors like so.
So I tried cutting them both with scissors and with a cutter. So as you can see, that's how it'll look like. And you can roll them together, including the template. That's kind of a contrast color, or in this case, it's not a contrast really, but more of like complementary color. So let's try and roll them, okay? Now, these are the ones here that I cut from the guillotine cutter if you have steady hand and you have long scissors you know scissors will work just as fine as uh, the cutter so here we go uh, you get your roller in my case I'm going to use my bamboo roller and you would I'm gonna show you rolling this two together now if you want really to keep that because once they're cut the they, they, they separate because if you remember we only put like a really thin glue on the edge of the paper so they separate but if you want that you know they will not be like sliding around just put like a little glue there on the base of your strip and then you roll so your beads would be kind of fatter But it's going to be pretty because it has that if you want a really contrast color you can put a black that would be hard to see with the egg you can put something like darker or maybe like yellow or purple but yeah, no, black wouldn't be a good idea because then you wouldn't see the print. It'd be hard to cut. So, look at that so far. And then, you know, you can cut this little, the template part. You can cut it so that, you know, it will not be. And then you can just glue it like this. The top and the bottom. And then what I was going to say, so that the tip of the template will not be showing. But if you want that to be showing, that's fine too. It depends on what your preference is. So as you can see, it came out really nice. Look at that, but you need more glue. And then we're going to uh, roll the rest, okay? Don't run. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Can you see it? The beads came out really nice. These ones were made rolling two sets together, meaning two of these with a layered template. So that really makes four, rolling four together. And you get this ones, the fatter beads. Now the skinnier ones were made by just rolling one set or two strips together and this was just like the leftover that formed like a tube like a rectangle like just like straight strips and it came out nice I love that color it's like the sunset
so there you go next video will be glazing them and making them into jewelry that's gonna be fun so uh, subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet and you will be notified when the next video comes up plus it's going to make us happy here thanks for watching